you're a dabbler, your 30s will be very painful. In your 20s, if you can decide there's some area of life that I wanna really be masterful in, I wanna know more about it, I wanna have more skill, more ability. I always tell people, if you wanna succeed, find some type of person, a client, a customer, a type of person that you wanna serve, somebody that you can fall in love with them. Not fall in love with your product or service, but fall in love with them and then develop the skills to meet all their, their needs, to go beyond what they can imagine. If you do that, if you become a master of anything, finance, photography, emotion, leadership, then if you do that in your 20s, when you hit your 30s, after a decade of refining those skills, you'll be coming into yourself and you'll be able to dominate any profession. You'll be able to enjoy your life at a different level. So I think one thing is don't dabble, be a master. Go deep instead of shallow. Most of our society today is all about the quick hit. It always feels good to start something new, start a new relationship, start a new job. And so many people become dabblers because it's like the sugar high. Everything's, when it's new, who can't be happy in a relationship when it's brand new, right? But if you go deep, if you're one of those people that masters relationship, masters your job, masters your profession, you're gonna be able to write your own ticket when you get in your 30s, 40s, and 50s. And I know if you're in your 20s, 50s sounds like centuries away, but it will come, I promise you, quicker than you think.